Hello, welcome back. This weekend I went and got some Christmas decor and I finally unpacked all my Christmas decor that I had stored away. So I really want to decorate my room slash decorate my bookshelf right now. You may notice that my bookshelf and like desk and floating shelves don't match and I'm aware of it. It's kind of annoys me, but beggars can't be choosers. I'm eventually someday I'll stain them all to match, but that day is not today. Also, my room is kind of a mess, but I'm just gonna hide those parts and pretend they don't exist. So look at her though, look at the fit. So some of this stuff is like, a lot of this stuff is from my either childhood home or bedroom, childhood bedroom. The theme might not match is what I'm trying to say, but I'm not gonna throw it out. So we're gonna work with what we have. And then I did do a little bit of shopping at Michael's with all the Black Friday deals, are you kidding me? So I can at the very least show you those. This is my vase from Valley Village. Love it so much. I got this a while ago and it's just like, you kind of can tell it's like ambery. And then I got some filler for the bottom of it finally. And then like a fake little decoration. I put a cinnamon stick in there. So it smells good. I was, I expected my vase to be a little bit bigger than it is. So I bought all of these and I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with them yet, but they're just making my room smell good now. I'm waiting for the Bath and Body Works sale because I really wanna get a candle. I haven't had a Bath and Body Works candle since I was like in middle school and I just really wanna, I want the nostalgia and I want the savings. I love a deal. I also have this that I got from Michaels when I was like in middle school, the glitter. You'll notice a lot of these things from my like middle school days have glitter all over them, which does shed quite a bit, but it's fine. Staying on theme, I have like two little nutcrackers. Again, like it's definitely not all gonna go together, but it'll feel festive and that's what matters. Then this is new. I bought this. It's like, why is that glare happening? It's this super cute candle. Let me take the tape off so it can like, so it doesn't just glare back. Oh. It honestly smells kind of good, but I really do not plan on burning it. I just think it's so pretty. I love it. And then I thought this matched that kind of vibe. They're like string light garlands. Super cute. I have a couple fake presents. And then I need to go to the thrift store to find some like candle holders but I got these two candles because I thought well this almost looks it's like a burgundy it almost looks black literally just does not look black but it's a burgundy and I thought it would look really cute and then from my middle school days I have this glitter tree and a glitter pine cone <laughs> that just fell And then that's it. I have a little bit of wall stuff, but I just really want to have a little chill moment decorating my bookshelf. decorating everything that I had. I feel like it looks cute. And then my little mantle. This is like all the silver and gold stuff. I know my alarm clock is like not the cutest, but I just think this is this shelf. I love this shelf. <laughs> 
and then I feel like I need something like right there because it looks kind of bare. I think it's cute. I think it's a work in progress, but it's cute. I'll update you as it like evolves. And then I think like the candles, the candle stand, I have nothing going on on the third shelf down, but I'll figure something out, I'm sure. I think I'm just gonna go to bed now and pick back up tomorrow. Good morning, except it's not morning. It is like 1 p.m., just turned 1 p.m. Currently editing or about to start editing and like put stuff in. I've got some little snack going on, apples and peanut butter. Like this is one of my favorite snacks. It's this like, it's cut up apples and then peanut butter with, yogurt and you mix it together like Greek yogurt you mix it together and then add cinnamon and it's so good and then I've got some coffee going to my second of the day um this morning I woke up and my friend and I went and got breakfast and like did some schoolwork next week is dead week and then I have finals so I'm a little terrified but I think I can do it today is a big chore day I have laundry going right now and then I'm probably gonna go to the gym maybe later, um, just for like a quick ab and cardio session perhaps. And then yeah, just homework, homework, homework. Maybe a little movie tonight, maybe a documentary. Not to be that person, but yeah, I'm on, usually I don't even have a full cup of coffee, but today I'm on two. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Probably will be a little crazy today, but I have so much I need to get done that I think that's for the best. I did so much laundry. But right now, I'm going to make my bed and fold my laundry and then maybe finally wash my hair because I meant to do it this morning and then time got away from me. It is the next day. Um, I honestly just passed out as soon as I was done with the laundry because I had so much laundry. It took me like two, three hours to like fold and put everything away. Also, my room was already a mess. Um, but today's a new day and I wanted to have a tiny bit more Christmas decor. Um, it's actually my snow globe collection and so I want to open that up on camera. I thought that'd be interesting. I honestly don't even remember all the ones I have so it should be fun. I think I'm gonna get a little snack, maybe a bit more coffee. Let's see. my snack of like peanut butter, oats, um, banana, cocoa powder, and agave, and then my coffee. The part that I just brewed was decaf, but there's like a little bit of my morning coffee left over, so yeah, I'm just gonna get a couple school things done, and then I'm gonna open my snow globes. All right, it's time. Let's all of the snow globes I have. <laughs> I got a 
Perfect Gold Box. I've collected these over my, as long as I can remember, really. I've just always loved snow globes. So I'm going to look through and decide which ones I want to put up this year. I have... <laughs> Dolphin from um, when I visited Seaside, Oregon. And then I have a Vegas snow globe that I think my, I think my sister got me that one. I have two. <laughs> And then I have a little Yosemite, this one's one of my favorites, a little Yosemite um, park one. Some of them you can see like the bases have tilted a bit, like this bear is kind of falling over. <laughs> oh, I really have to play that. Um, oh. This one's from when I went to New York. Oh, I love this one. This one's staying out for sure. I love them all, but I forgot about that one. This is from when I went to Disneyland. Isn't it so cute? Santa Cruz. I think my friend got me this, maybe? Now we're going to the big ones. I, I get one every year for Christmas as well. This is my 2015 one. It's the um, Three Wise Men. But the base on this is like also coming off. Which is sad. This is, here we have a baby, a baby Christmas one. So that one's gotta come out because it's Christmassy. Oh, this is one of my like first large ones. Wait, that's literally a lie. Okay, but this is my 2017 Christmas snow globe. It's yellowing, you can see. And like the water is. That's so sad. I also don't understand that, like, how is my 2015 one not having that issue? And then the last one's another Vegas one. And this one. Oh, wait. Did I show this one? No, I didn't. This one's really cute. And then this guy. I'm pretty sure I have some more somewhere, but I don't know where. So I just want to show you, and then I think I'm gonna put this one in my room, and this one in my room. And this one's yellowing, but I kind of want to put it in my room. And then any Christmas ones. But yeah. <laughs> end the video there um actually kind of filmed this a while ago but literally the day that i filmed that time lapse i had the flu didn't know and then got diagnosed the next day so i have kind of been in recovery mode but thank you for watching i'll see you in the next one